Well, it was kind of a crazy night. Some people out there on the main trail, way over there, yelling what sounded like dog names. You know, saying, here you go. Come on. That was about like 3 o'clock in the morning. So, it was a little spooky. But, uh, this is what I wanted to show you. Always check your boots. Now that's the rain I was looking for. I would say that's pretty effective. Well here we go, day three. Let's see what we can get into today, huh? Everything's soaked. It finally did rain and uh the uh, the quantity of rain that I was looking for uh, was able to fill up all my water bottles the water is really really good of course you still want to filter it like I said before because everything you know in the trees gets inside the water so you still want to filter it but uh, it tastes really really good and very clean but uh but yeah just relaxing it's already 11 and I haven't done anything except, you know, the normal morning routine, you know, coffee, you know what, and I'm not much of a breakfast guy, so I don't really eat a whole lot of breakfast, but I did get this grapefruit from yesterday, so looks like something been tapping into it. Sorry, he didn't get all the way in. It's all right. Cool. All right, well, let's see what else we can get into today. Cool. Cool, check out what I found. This is crawling around in my backpack. I knew that they were out here, but uh, I didn't see any last night. Now I'm uh, looking at a nice big one now. Let's check this out.
Oh, he's gone down in that little hole. Shit. I'm sorting out my bags and getting them organized and um, then I spotted this guy come crawling out of one of the little, uh, little crannies there. So gotta be careful because if I didn't see him and I put my backpack on bam hit me in the back of the neck or something woo, that wouldn't feel very good let's see how big he is I got a little ruler in my other bag let's check this out Remember in a previous video, I was telling you guys about uh, if you shine a UV light on them, they will um, glow, kind of like a greenish glow. Check this out. <laughs> All right, let's go take this guy off somewhere else. Well, it's uh, always imperative that you check your gear, especially out here. You saw the thing with the boots, full of spiders, got rid of all those, and I checked all my bags, and, and sure enough, we got a, a couple of biting insects in there. One of them is sort of like a, a wheel bug. I've heard that those bite, but they also carry a bacteria that's really harmful, and uh, obviously the scorpion. That was really cool, though. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, finish organizing my stuff, and then uh, I'm gonna go get get uh, go get muddy somewhere. All right, cool. Oh, cool! Check this out. This here is a yellow rat snake, and it's huge. I'm gonna try to catch it. The thing is, I won't need Mr. Pinchy for this one. Alright, here it goes. snake it's a big one too looks like she gotten into some tangles before because there's some scar tissue there I don't know if it's a boy or a girl or not but let's see how big she is
hurt you now. <laughs> I'd say it's a good more than four feet long. Get her into the camera. There she goes. Oh, there she is. such a cool snake. They're so pretty. And they will bite you. They will. Well, I'm going to let this one go and uh, we'll see what else we can get into. So far, so good this morning. Oh man, that was great. You know, it's funny thing about that musk. It stinks right off the bat, but after after about an hour or so, it actually kind of has like a nice perfumey smell to it. I know it sounds weird. I know it sounds crazy, but after a while, it starts smelling pretty good. I, I don't have a problem with it. Well, anyway, all right.